know by now, the library has closed for the safety of all of us during the COVID-19 or coronavirus. Okay, so here we are in my kitchen. I'm going to make homemade butter. Once I started, I just had so many that I wanted to put on this list. So this list is absolutely limited. Actually, my iron is back at the library from a previous craft that I did. So I do not have an iron at home right now. <laughs> I have Miles, my nephew, and Elizabeth, my niece. Back to read to you chapter six and seven of Miss Hall is a Goofball. I know at this time things might seem a little bit scary or uncertain, so let's try this together. So if you're stuck at home and you're looking for something good to listen to, these are my top five audiobook picks for children. Being at home, you can find all kinds of things or any kinds of things that you can use to make music. Looks like these are good to go. I just thought that I would get some fresh air. Once again, I have my three helpers. You ready, guys? I am back to eat more of Meat Cute. Time for a little bit of a calm meditation. Um, because it's Mother's Day, I've chosen two books uh, about mamas because we love our mama so much. And boys and girls, I have a special guest here. My son Shlomi is going to sing the rap song for you that Mr. Hyde sang. You say tomatoes, well so do I. And it is Wednesday, April 22nd, 2020, and it is Happy Earth Day. Oh, you might be saying to yourself, what is that? It's like a cake and a pudding, but in one dish. Uh, we did get a little bit into Harry Potter here. I'm a Ravenclaw. What are you? And I'm back to read a brand new read aloud to you. Today, I'm going to talk to you about what I'm doing with my time when I'm away from the library. Um, and that is fostering a rabbit. And today we're going to do a stuffed animal meditation. And I am back this week with my cat Alfredo to talk about some of my favorite kitty books. Today I'm going to read to you two bedtime stories. I'm going to make whipped coffee. So what you're left with is this. And next week when we come back to hear chapter three. Your whole body out. You put your whole body in and you shake it all around. Today we're outside. It's so beautiful out. Oh, it's such a beautiful day today. I thought I would sit out on my porch, on my front porch, and read you my stories from here. Hi hey everyone, Miss Elizabeth here. Just wanted to make a quick video to let you know that our reference departments are open Monday to Friday, 10 to 6 via phone. And today I'm going to talk to you about online book browsing. This is Welcome to Imagine What You Can Do at Home, one of the really fun programs we have this summer. To, it's starting to mix. So you can just drop them right in there, but you need to separate them a little bit. Magical unicorn charm in there. Pour it into my funnel, and I'm just going to let it of our Teen Summer Art Series. So today we're going to be making cold porcelain, which is just a type of air dry clay. As you can see, I am in one of my favorite places to be at, which 
aqui de frente. Need to make a kindness box. This is your kit. So it's gonna end up looking something like this. Hi guys! So the very first raffle prize that we are going to pull is the animal lovers basket. Critter week. There's lots of different kinds of critters throughout the world. So hopefully you have picked up your craft kit at the library. How it's gonna look. This is what I'm just doing right now. And I'm sure you will have a fun time doing it and making, your, making it your own. I guarantee you, by spring, guests will be eating yummy, yummy lima beans. Pretzels are golden brown, so we are all set. Uh you can go back and add the other Alcatel seltzer tab later so you can see how cool this is and it can do it again. And then you have your unicorn necklace that you can give to someone that you care about a lot. So Even glued a few of those gems like I showed you that I'm going to put in your bags. And that is your flower mosaic. Yours look anything like mine? Right. And then all we have to do is make blank empty book spines. Ahoy, mateys, and welcome to Bookworm Crafters and Get a Clue Week. 